There really is nothing like giving back, and Silver Bluffs Teron Jackson has been for the past three years. The former Coastal Carolina and current defensive end for the Eagles put on another kids' camp at the Bluff. More than 70 kids took part in the same drills that Jackson once participated in on the same field. It was even more special this year when he had his former coach alongside him to lead the next generation of Bulldogs at his own camp. Jackson has come a long way since he suited up in silver, but days like this in the middle of OTAs is just a reminder of why he put on the pads in the first place. Man, I love it. Man, Coach Hayes actually kind of convinced me to come back and start playing football because, you know, I kind of started off playing basketball, and in my sophomore year I came back. And, uh, man, Coach Hayes, he did a lot for me, man. He used to pick me up from uh, home, you know, whenever I didn't have a ride for summer workouts, come here, and we'll pass out on the field running 100s and 110s. But, you know, it was all those good experiences, man, and, you know, he's the right type of person that you want to have as a head coach, so, you know, I'm happy. Teron Jackson's a, a big part of Silver Bluff. I was able to coach him when I coached here earlier, and, uh, Love him. He's one of my favorite players, my favorite students. My wife taught him. He's just he's just one of one of a kind. So having a third third camp in a row, third annual camp here, special. <laughs> Me coming back as first year head coach when he called and says, "Can we get it set up?" I said, "Absolutely." Jackson brought a few of his teammates from Coastal to help out alongside Silver Bluff coach Matt Hayes. A couple of college athletes from the Silver Bluff program were also on hand, like Christian Eccles, who's prepping for his first season at Charleston Southern.